Hi friends, welcome to Live Watch Channel. This is Mr. Nivas. I'm very sorry. Uh, it was a long gap since I last posted a video. I could not make many videos because I was not well. So now I'm all right. I have started drawing video for YouTube. So today I'm going to draw the very famous and veteran actor in South India. He is very famous for his action movie. He has a nickname called Action King Arjun. Especially he has a lot of fan base for his physique. And this is usual thing I start from my eyeball and uh, I use a normal HP pencil for initial drawing because it is very easy to erase. But I don't want to give more important to the outline part. It's a usual thing that I start from my and finish. So I is the key part. Following the eye, I'll draw other part like uh, nose, eyeball, I mean second eye, eyebrow. And then mustache and I, I mean lips and other stuff. If your inner part of the face is good, then outer line is easy outer part I have drawn now and then hair following that neck and then jacket now rough line is over next I'll be doing a final outline with the 8B pencil and uh, brown pencil on the skin. Once the final outline is over, we'll be erasing all unwanted line. Okay. So now, almost the final outline is over. After this, we will see coloring session. I am erasing unwanted lines. Next, I am using uh, blue color for base on the hair. Next, taking a Stella 8B pencil and doing shade. Also, drawing the hair lines based on his character and the flow. Always be careful on the hair style. Follow the exact thing which is in the picture draw the direction of the hair wherever it goes flowing so do that properly without mistake no compromise on the dark area you don't worry make it full dark only on the light area the lines will be visible then you can take a brown pencil start shading with the single dark brown pencil you can make light and shadow you can separate the light and shadow on the face nose Do light and shadow with a brown pencil like a monochromatic. After that you can add tones and reflections in dark wherever required. You can check I am just doing only with a single pencil. See 
now it looks like a monochromatic drawing but later you will see what are the color pencils i'm going to use on the clean shave area and for mustache and eyebrow and around the eye see now i'm using purple for giving doctor val sorry dot value on eye area for the part which connects chin and neck i'm giving a brown i mean purple color also using green and blue for the clean shave area uh, i mean for hair and i mean eyebrow and mustache giving dark green to look little realistic but we cannot give a direct black on the hair area before that we need to give some base colors so after this i'm using pe i'm using peach color to fill up the light area we cannot leave as a sheet white directly so you have to fill with the peach color and also around the neck and here use brown pencil blend with the peach color and then improving the hair tones it looks so white giving dark to that now eyebrow looks good right so second right side eyebrow is also good but still i i feel like uh, the right side eye is a little up from the left side eye so we can correct them also right uh, darkening the hair part all the time you require a lot of improvisation to look the portrait very beautiful you keep on work until you get good portrait keep on changing color keep on adding colors you compare the original picture with your drawing in case if you miss anything then you can add something right okay now lips for lips i'm giving a brown and pink so darkening the neck area obviously in all the portrait there will be a dark shadow under the chin on the neck then only your chin will bring front otherwise it will be merged with the neck so after this we should color the jacket but jacket is not much color so it's a black and white before that i am doing a background with a black and a green color right first i'm giving a black but i don't want to give much detailing on the jacket it takes long time so i stop with a simple stroke also giving background with a green color on the black shades so i'm a little closer to the eye shades i'm using black pencil for eyeballs so eyeballs are very must for portrait eyeballs are very attractive for the viewers if your eyeball is good then audience will automatically attracted by your drawing okay so almost we are in the end of the session so i hope that you are liking this video so if you like this give a thumb on the like button 
also subscribe into my channel so i'll be coming with uh, many videos in future thank you thank you so much thanks for watching